In honor of Black History Month today, speakers took to the stage at Chesapeake High School to share their stories. Two of them grew up in Anne Arundel County, and Amy Kawada joins us with why students say these moments are so important to take in. It was a day to celebrate Black History Month, highlighting the achievements made by African Americans in our community and throughout the state of Maryland. It's very important for people to know where they came from and because everyone in the past had to work hard to get what we have now. Student organizers at Chesapeake High School say the goal is to educate and inspire others. And I think if they learn more about it, they could appreciate what they have in life more and maybe strive to do what they can with it. Today, speakers from all walks of life visited the school to share a glimpse of their lives before and after the civil rights movement. The day kicked off with Yolanda Dickerson, who grew up in the area. I went to all black school in the 1950s in Anne Arundel County, northern Anne Arundel County, a four room brick schoolhouse, the first brick schoolhouse in Anne Arundel County. And her sister, Aldona Price. We were going to be doing something different from what my sisters and brothers did. We were going to attend a white school and it was us who were going to be integrating it. We were one of the first classes at school. I, and it wasn't easy. Students say it's important to keep these memories of our past alive. The further the generations go, the more and more this is in the past and we don't, we don't want it to just disappear. Amy Kawada for WJZ.